how to play that. Gotta use your noggin. That's my secret. No, I'm, I'm just joking. This is how to play my, uh, my personal arrangement of Savior Redeemer of My Soul, uh, which uses um, the more popular melody uh, by Rob Gardner, as well as at the beginning, I'm sort of trying to reconfigure the chord structure around the original melody, which not a lot of people know, if they even know the song to begin with. So you're gonna keep this in your right hand and move your left hand, so you go. And as you see, uh, the second time over, I put in that. That was in the right hand. This is sort of suspended, and I like to put it down just a hairline afterwards to give it that extra resonance, so it's... cluster chord. Who's mighty hand. So that's almost exactly the same as the first cluster chord, except you take out that and then put in a lower bass. So it's, Who's mighty hand hath made me So there you're putting in pretty much the most important chord that is introduced inside the entire piece. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself anyway. So, and then you go into, back to the cluster chord. And filled with sweet. You're pushing in the sweetness, whether they like it or not. Catch them completely off guard. Sweet, my and right when they think that they're safe, bitter. bitter cup. So that's. So you bring in that last. And then you go into. It's a very, uh, what kind of chord, wouldn't you say? Unless you happen to be me, uh, then it's absolutely normal. What tongue my gratitude. And then you just move up the bass. Dude can tell. Back to the what chord. And I like to just bring in the left hand and then slam down the right hand afterwards. And then you go into, um, actually, this is where the second melody by Gardner comes in. Oh, gracious God. So you're keeping this in the right hand, and then you move up the bass. And then for the last one, you don't move it up a full. So it's... So you keep the thumb, so it's... Oh, gracious God. Of back to the white chord. that down. You keep alternating between these two, like your uh, Tinkerbell flittering around, and then you, from your thumb, alternate between these two notes, and then you do the same basic pattern down here. You're still moving the thumb. Gardner melody. So it's exactly the same pretty much except you just bring that down 
to give it a more introspective feeling. Savior, Redeemer of my soul. Sometimes I like to sometimes I like to keep this bass down and then bring in a C sharp over there. And sometimes I like to bring it up. Uh, my fingers slip sometimes and then really nice things happen and those those happy accidents as Bob Ross would say are what I live for in fact they're the only reason that I can arrange it all how about that the more you know and so then at the very uh, last verse you uh, kind of go back to this except now you're actually raising it up to the fullness to the full Sounds like a metaphor for something. Thank you so much. 